Thank you for listening to my submission to the Daniel Guitardo guitar competition. Now, I know what you're thinking. You're thinking, this guy didn't really play guitar. Uh, I did it all with my tongue. Um, however, you need to understand that I do qualify for this competition, and that's because when I was a little boy, I couldn't afford a guitar. My daddy had 18 children, and he couldn't afford to buy one for me. One day I was uh, downtown. And uh, I was behind a guitar shop, and they threw away a whole bunch of guitar parts. I think Jimi Hendrix had come through town and uh, he had broken a whole bunch of them. It could have been the Who. And there were a bunch of humbucking pickups in there, some single-coil pickups. There was uh, several necks of guitars in different bodies. And so what I did was I took them all home, and I, I uh, cut them all up with my dad's chainsaw. And over the course of about three months, I consumed every part so what happened was, after I did that, a miracle happened that the musicality from all those parts went coursing through my veins, and I became a human guitar. And I'm able to articulate my music through my tongue, uh, just like you would with your fingers, except my tongue is much more efficient than your fingers. It's much quicker than your fingers. I mean, check this out. I mean, in one second, I can play probably two or 300 notes. I've never uh, counted. But uh, take that and slow it down sometime, and you'll see what I just did was two or 300 notes. And you just can't do that with your fingers. Um, a little bit about my influences. You know, Ingve Malmsteen is always saying that uh, he uh, basically grew up musically in a vacuum and that uh, he has no influences. And, of course, we know that Lee Baracci and John Denver were major influences. Listen to those early demos, and you'll hear licks from both those guys, both those cats, all over the place. So um, I'd like to honor my influences. Number one, the number one shredder of all time, Sean Lane, uh, and uh, also Wild Man Fisher for articulation. And to hit those high notes, um, I was definitely influenced by Tiny Tim. So uh, anyway, you take those three and you uh, combine them with the human guitar that I am, which qualifies me to enter this contest because since I am a guitar and I am playing me, uh, that qualifies me to be in this guitar competition. Um, so without further ado, uh, I'd like you to go back and listen to me again now that you understand that I qualify to be here, and um, thank you for helping me to realize my dream. Goodbye.